The U.S. women's national team will soon hit the pitch and carry. Yep, it's the first game of the 2018 CONCACAF Championship. Our Colleen Quigley is live tonight as fans are getting ready for this matchup. Colleen. Oh yeah, lots of excitement here at Wake Med Soccer Park. We're a little over an hour away from the kickoff when the U.S. National Women's Soccer Team will take on Mexico. We caught up with some of those fans. Obviously, there's a lot of excitement for this tournament in particular because it is a World Cup qualifier, meaning three of the eight teams playing over the course of the next week will move on to punch their ticket to the World Cup, which is next year in France. A lot of the people out here rooting for Team USA, they're decked out in their red, white, and blue. We saw people waving American flags. People told me they're really excited that a tournament of this caliber with international teams is going on right here in Cary. And one couple we caught up with, they told us they drove up from Wilmington. They were actually uh, impacted by Hurricane Florence. So they wanted to come today just trying to get, to get away from it, to take their mind off of things and enjoy the game. They told me they're huge Courage fans. So I asked them who specifically on Team USA they were rooting for. Any of the Courage players. Yes, Crystal any of our Courage players. She's going to get a goal. Yeah. Crystal will yes, get a goal. Yes, Crystal will get a goal. <laughs> All right, they're talking about Crystal as in Crystal Dunn, a UNC alum and obviously a Courage player. Other fans told us they are so excited to see Alex Morgan play here tonight. And you can be here too. I'm told there are still plenty of tickets left. Again, the kickoff is at 7.30. And if you come on down to Wake Med Soccer Park, just go to the, the box office at the gate and they have seats available for you to purchase and enjoy the game. And the women are playing tonight. They'll play again on Sunday and then they'll play again next Wednesday. Reporting live in Cary, Colleen Quigley, CBS 17 News.